has been a lot of, lot of upgrades in the last handful of years in the maple industry. Um, one of the biggest things is we've got into 3 16 tubing. Some of the other technology, ROs. There's ROs right from hobby to full size. Um, there's a lot of research done. The check valves have, have panned out well for us. There's a lot of new items over the last handful of years. As far as the 3 16 tubing goes, <laughs> it's really taken hold, really taken off. There's a place for it. You've got, if you're steep and everything's right, I think it's a great thing. Um, it draws its own vacuum. Um, they don't have the expense. It's a much cheaper install. Um, I, think it, I think it has made sat production much higher for certain people. Everybody's trying to run that 26, 27 inches vacuum. And um, with a good 3 16 setup in the right conditions, you can do that without a vacuum pump. Vacuum pump, in my opinion, is one of the biggest things profitability-wise that you need to put in your system if, if you intend to make money. Um, I think vacuum pumps pay for themselves in one year. In most cases, what they do is change the atmospheric pressure at the tap hole. It allows the sap to run much easier. Your yields are much, much, much greater running vacuum. That's the same point of running the 3 16 tubing to create its own natural vacuum, um, but you've got to be steep. There's places for both, absolutely. RO seems to be the name of the game anymore. It's a reverse osmosis. Um, what it does basically is you're taking a portion, whatever you decide you want to do, a portion of the water out of the sap before you have to boil it. Sap in most cases is 98% is or so water. If you're boiling at 2% sweet sap, it's taking you 43 gallons. If you're boiling at 10% sweet sap, it's taking you like eight and a half or so. Great tool, great tool, great efficiency tool. The yields back 50, 60 years ago, I mean, I don't even think people would even consider being possible to have yields like we feel it is a, a normal day occurrence now. Really consider maple. It's fun. I enjoy it a lot um, and I do believe it's a profitable venture if done correctly.